All right, everybody, welcome back to Dead Space. It is the day after election day, and uh, yeah, that's about all I have to say about that. Um, so I'm getting my mind off of it by uh, killing space zombies with my uh, with my uh, future fucking staple gun. It's all right, McCoy. He's here. Nothing to be afraid of. <laughs> I knew you would come. Just like you said. I, I saved this. Alright then, so uh, this poor woman is cradling the dismembered corpse of her significant other, I presume. That's a lot of maggots. That's a lot of maggots. So right here it's gonna, um, what was it, circle? Okay. The controls haven't been the same in every game, in Dead Space, uh, in Dead Space 2 and 3, uh, the stasis controls were different, so that's taken me a little bit of uh, time to get used to. Um, and here we have a whole bunch of bodies wrapped up in whatever. And uh, here's a store, which I don't think I have the money to buy anything there because I just bought this little number, which I'm going to save for uh, later. <laughs> Anyway, so you can pick up things and throw them now, and that'll be really handy because... Schematics! Cool! Flamethrower! We're not going to be using that, but cool. Um, Alright, oh my god, what's waiting for me around here? <laughs> Ivan, are you there? We were attacked. Kendra's gone. One minute she was there, and I, I can't believe I lost her. We can still do this. Get me the captain's rig codes, and we'll find Nicole. Looks like the crew barricaded the door to the emergency wing. We have to blow through it to get to the morgue. Get some thermite from medical storage, and a shock pad from zero-g therapy. Should be down the corridor. Communication is useless in all this static. All right. Yeah, I know how he. I know how he lost Kendra. You weren't paying fucking attention. There's flies in here, my god. You see how the lighting is so, like, stark and nasty? Like, ugh, god. It wasn't like this in the other games. Like, coming back and playing this again after years of having not played it. Um. You know. It's just, uh, you know, it's an eye-opener. Uh, I think that I am going to... Yeah, it's probably the safe bet. Go ahead and buy a little bit of extra ammo. Um, God, what are we doing here? We're going to save. That's, that's one thing we're going to do. <laughs> oh, that's definitely a good plan. So I wouldn't mind finding out what's behind this door, if anything. I don't actually know. What we got here? God. How is he even still alive to be doing all that? Like, pulse rounds. <laughs> Excuse me, that came on really fast. I didn't even have time to warn you guys. Uh, what's in here? Oh, God. Yeah, I don't know about that. 
Yeah, maybe I should maybe I should stick with my objective. Uh yeah. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should do that. Alright. Research wing. Come on. Yes, yes, I know. Science! Where would you be without it? Uh, maybe, maybe these guys didn't have science, and that's why they're here. Let me just go with that. Okay. So we're looking for some thermite, huh? Oh, this room. I remember this room. This could be a little bit scary. Hazardous anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. Ah. Uh oh. Ah, this is a lot. Ah. Jesus. You hear some of the noises those fucking things make? Ah. Oh goddamn. So the quarantine's still down, so that means that there's still some things running around here. God, that's not terrifying at all. You can hear them, like, pounding around in the doors and, like, gagging on their own fluids. It's coming from over here. Or no, it's coming from here, somewhere. Maybe below me? I'm wearing headphones, I can tell. Sort of. Uh... Uh oh, man. oh god. You What? Oh my god. Ah, fuck. Oh, thank God. Ah, God. I was trying to I was trying to kinesis some some I was trying to kinesis some body parts so that I could use those as weapons, but Jesus. Look at that, there's like little tentacles coming out of it. Ugh. So, like, the main inspiration for this series, as I understand it, was actually, uh, The Thing, I believe. Like, the, uh, I don't remember if that was, uh, I don't remember who did that. Steven something. 
It's either Stephen King or Steven Spielberg. One of those two, I think. I could be completely wrong about that. But it was about a. Uh, it's about these people that found this uh, virus in the uh, in the Antarctica, and uh, it basically when you got in. What in God's name what? is going on down there? I think that's precisely the point, Doctor. God's work. I'm not so sure of that. We have to assume that the colony's problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. The marker is glorious and divine. You... you know that. God knows in mysterious ways. Anyway, we'll have it on board tomorrow. You can analyze it all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness? The transformation unitology teaches us? Doctor. Terrence. There will always be risk when the stakes are high. And here, they're enormous. It could change everything. Sorry to interrupt that, but I do want to go ahead and save. And that's what worries me. Alright, so this is where I'm supposed to be going. I'm not sure if I fully explored everything there, but... Oh god. Come on! Come on! Let me out! No! So those are babies. How does that grab you? God. That's just, that's just mean. Alright, let me in. Because God knows, in this room is where I want to be. Ah, whoa, hey, hey, hey now. Fuck off, buddy. So thankfully those guys are pretty easy to, uh, dispose of as soon as they get a hold of you as long as you can get them off you in the first place Isaac can one shot him with his trusty curb stomp <laughs> but uh yeah uh anyway what was I talking about yes that's right the thing so um they find this virus that basically uh like, as soon as you... Like, it, it gives somebody fever, and as soon as it kills them, it structurally reconfigures their body and reanimates them. And that is... Dude, come on, show me your tentacles! Ah, god damn it! Get off me! Just wasted a bunch of ammo on you, asshole. Uh, um, and that's essentially... That is essentially... What is happening here, to an extent. Except in the thing, it was a little bit more pronounced, I think? Like, you, like things just completely... I don't know. The, if you haven't seen that movie, it's got a fucking... Um, What's his name? God, I can't remember. Uh, what is his name? Shit. I don't remember. He was in uh, Escape from L.A. and a couple other things. I don't remember. All right. That thermite you picked up should be able to melt through the barricade. Use the shark pad to ignite it. Hope I can hold this position. I can hear something big moving out there. Um, but, uh, anyway, so, um, God, what is his name? Hold on, I'm going to Google it real quick. Uh, thing. Kurt Russell. I knew Russell was in his name somewhere, but I didn't want to say that was his first name. Because I knew it wasn't, but... Yeah. It's got that. It's got that dude. Uh, 
And so that and um, that and uh, Event Horizon and Alien were a big. Uh, having trouble getting his arm there. Kept getting his head. Stupid, wobbly, fucking, flip floppy head was getting in the way of your arm. Uh. I don't have any. Shit. You know, any fucking health packs. Shit. Okay. Alright. I may have to switch to, uh, to this guy. Just to be sure that, uh. I can properly, uh. Properly defend myself against whatever may be in store for me once I plant this bomb. Although, actually, wait a minute. I'm back here. There's a store. Yeah, okay. It's all good. I'll just, uh, I'll buy some, uh, yeah, I'll buy some, uh, some med packs here. Or maybe I'll buy one because, actually, hold on, can I sell anything? I'm very, I'm very wary of selling ammunition. But, uh, eh, you know what? Ammunition's no good to me if I can't stay alive. That's not much. It's only two health packs of the, of the small variety. So I don't know how much help it's going to be, but wait. What? Oh, I have to go that way now. Shit. All right, here we go. Come on, man, open up. <laughs> Don't make me wait to, to see all the horrible, horrible, traumatic things. So, uh, like, yeah, the thing, Event Horizon, which is basically like Satan in space, kind of, <laughs> type of thing. Uh, okay. Those lights aren't a good thing. Um, I think I need to, yeah, I need to do this number. Not really sure what they were trying to accomplish there. Yeah, I know, I got it. Come on. Ah! I do the whole short controlled burst thing on these guys. Yeah, it was this game that taught me in shooters to uh, not just unload with fully automatic weapons, because you'll really fuck yourself over. I feel like there's more. There's more. I feel like there's more bad things that are going to happen in this room. That's what I feel like right now. Oh God. Oh, dude. I'm sorry, man. Bro. I don't even know... What, what, you have a, a, a heroin or overdose? Like, what the fuck is that? Choking on your own vomit there? Ah! Whoa! Holy fuck! Ah! God damn! Fuck you! Ah! Ah, oh, Jesus. Ugh.
Here I was thinking it was safe. It's time. Yeah, it's time for me to get the fuck out of here. Jesus. Hold on. Let me pick this up. This will be good. I can shoot this at things. No, no, no! Give me the thing! Give it! Give it! God damn it! That's so much for me getting to use a thing. Wait. What did I do? What did I do wrong? There's no... There's no thing. God damn it. Oh boy. What 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 do I need to do here? I need to What am I missing here? Oh, I thought it was God, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. I thought I was supposed to pull the thing up. Ah, fuck. Gotta need stasis. Ah, fuck, fuck, fuck. Ah. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that was very close to dead. Ah. Need a second to catch my breath after that one. Fuck. Whew. Okay. Um. What the fuck was I doing? What did I even come up here for? Oh, there was a stasis thing here the whole time. God damn it. What am I doing? What's the... What do I need to do here? Help. Somebody? God, is there more? Is there more stupid shit? Is that what I'm... Is that what I'm getting out of this? Why can't I... Is there another place for me to put the battery thing? I gotcha. I gotcha. I think. Maybe I don't gotcha. What? Oh my god. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time telling where to where to go with this. Alright, I guess I need to bring you back over here. And... Okay. What? What? Oh, come on! There's a door back here for some reason. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Oh, goodness. Uh, Alright, so... Zero-G therapy? I don't know about that. That doesn't sound like it's, uh, like it's a fun time. This is fairly claustrophobic. Not really much here. Oh! Yeah, I got that. Um, oh, God. 
I know that there's things that pop out here. I know that much. Yeah, I got it. You're running out of air. As you know, Yishimura is able to set his gravity locally. The ground boost will kick in when you enter a zero-g area. I want to go back out there because I think there was other stuff. I'm almost positive there was other stuff floating around out here. Uh... Well, I don't know. I guess there's not. Oh, hey. Dude, Isaac, stop gasping, please. It's really unsettling. You're not... You still got 30 whole seconds left. Relax, buddy. It's gonna be fine. Ugh. Oh, I don't like this. Your ammo counter will flash red if you can't jump to a surface. Um L1 That's right, I remember how this works now. Zero G is completely different in the new games. I like the, the zero G ambience that plays in the background. It's really really uh very dark sounding, I like it. Has that dark ambient, drony kind of tone to it. Ooh, yeah, that's what I needed. What is this? Oh, hey, it's the thing. Great. You got a shock pad. Combine that with the thermite at the barricade to destroy it. Shit. I can hear more coming. Moving through the vents. Stay safe, Isaac. All right. Uh, I'm going to cut the episode here, and next time we will uh, do more stuff. Bye.